Hi, today we are going to learn about CodeIgniter session with database driver. As default, CodeIgniter session uses the cookie driver. Therefore, we need to do a little setup in the config file. Let's open up the config.php file. It should be located under the application slash config directory. Scroll down until you see the session config block and change the ses driver option equals to database. Also, change the ses save path option equals to the name of our session table in the database. For example, session underscore table with quotes. And save this config file. Next, we are going to set up the database connection. Still under the application slash config directory, open up the database.php file. Scroll down until you find the database default options. Type in your database name, database username, and password. Keep the password option empty if you didn't set any password to log in to your database. To test if the database connection is correct, simply open the autoload.php file under the application slash config directory and then add the string database inside the library's array. Open up your browser and hit the application URL. If you have any incorrect database configuration, there will be errors displayed for you. In this case, we haven't created the database just yet. Open your favorite MySQL client. In this tutorial, we're going to use phpMyAdmin and create a new database with a name that matches the database configuration we set before. Now, refresh your application's URL, and if no errors occur, then our database configuration is perfectly correct. To test our session configuration, let's get back to the autoload.php file and add the string session inside the library's array, that is, after the database string separated by comma. Next, get back to your browser and refresh the page. Again, if you have any incorrect session configurations, there will be errors displayed for you. In this case, we haven't created the session table. Let's go and create it. Go to your phpMyAdmin, select the database, and click the SQL button to write and execute our table schema query. Type in this. Click the Go button to execute the query. Get back to our Applications tab and refresh the page. No errors means that our session configurations are correct. Now, if you see this session table in phpMyAdmin, there should be a new record. In CodeIgniter, every visit to our application is stored in a session variable. In the case that we use database for our session, every visit will be stored in a record on the session table. So that is how we configure CodeIgniter's session with database driver. I hope you enjoyed the tutorial and I'll see you in the next video.